Welcome to Now Loading for the week of July 22nd, 2015. We've got a lot to hit this week and we're going to move fast, so let's get right into it. As for releases this week, make sure you check out Tembo the Badass Elephant for the PC, Xbox One, and PlayStation 4. This is a digital release being published by Sega that is basically the classic 16-bit Sonic the Hedgehog gameplay style with a whole new look. You're a mercenary elephant out to take down a terrorist group and rescue hostages. Plays very much like the classic Sonic games but looks a lot nicer and is a ton of fun. PlayStation 4 owners can pick up the digital release of Journey, the critically acclaimed 2012 PS3 games, now getting the full upgrade treatment with 1080p visuals running at a smooth 60 frames per second. It looks and plays better and is still the same great game that got a bunch of various awards for 2012. My personal pick for game releases this week though is Phantom Breaker Battlegrounds Overdrive for the PlayStation 4. This will be dropping closer to the weekend and Phantom Breaker Battlegrounds is easily one of my favorite games in the past couple years. This is a 16-bit style retro beat-em-up with pixelated visuals. It plays a lot like the classic Final Fight and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle arcade games but has an extra layer of depth in the form of an RPG-like system where you upgrade and improve your characters over time. I have loved it on every system it's come out for thus far and will be picking it up on this one as well. Fighting game fans are going to get their chance to check out Street Fighter V this week as the online beta test launches for the PlayStation 4. This is a one week beta test for those who have pre-ordered the game through their favorite retailer. It will feature all six of the playable characters that were announced up through E3 and feature online matches only. The whole purpose of this test is to check the online netcode and see how well the game performs online and to check Capcom's content distribution system as it will launch with four characters on Thursday and two more will be added over the weekend. If you want more information on any of these games and a whole lot more, make sure you check out GamingNexus.com.